The next page in our art journal is using the shape of your fingerprint to create faces to express your mood. Let's take a look at these that I have finished. You would never guess that these little polka dots in yellow, orange, and green were actually my thumbprint. And then I used ink to draw my moods on top. So let's see what you need to do to make your own. So I've got my sketchbook. And I'm gonna open it to page one. And then for supplies, you're going to need some stamp pads, some permanent um, ink pens that have some fine tips to them, a ruler, some colored pencils, and a pencil. Now we're gonna create a border on our page. So we'll need our ruler and pencil. And you're just gonna measure in an inch and a half in two spots around the page. So from each border of the sketchbook, come in an inch and a half, and here and here, and two more spots. And then this is going to be the start kind of of our grid as well. So then now that you have your two spots, you're gonna line up your ruler and lightly, you don't need a light, uh, dark line here, lightly connect your dots. And I'm gonna come over here and just draw a line to make a rectangle shape on your page. And then that gives us a, a border start. Then we're gonna measure in two inches in each spot. And this will start dividing our page into two inch rectangles. And you can make as many little squares or um, boxes as you want on your page, or you don't have to make a grid at all. It's your sketchbook, so you can do what you want. But I'm making a little grid for all my fingerprint people to lift. So you will just continue on measuring out your boxes. I'm gonna turn the page because I have one ready for you. And you can see I've started um, darkening the grid with an ink pen. So all you have to do is go over each box or each line to make a box. And then you would wanna use an eraser to get rid of your pencil lines. And I don't have to use my ruler every time because it's handmade and I like kind of my wiggly lines. Or you can use a ruler. Then if you want to, you can use colored pencils to doodle a border and kind of make it more decorative around your fingerprint people. But this is my favorite part, the actual fingerprints. So all I've done is pressed my thumb really well into an ink pad and then you're just going to stamp it in the center of a box. And you wanna use washable inks because it's on my thumbprint now. And then you have a neat impression of your um, finger. Then you can either draw your face with a pencil or um, I've done this a time or two, so I'm just gonna start drawing my moods on my thumbprints. So you can add, like this we would call an open mouth smile and you can make some little dimples. You can invent all kinds of features like a nose, you can make his eyebrows really tall, little polka dot eyes. I think this guy should have a hat on, so we'll just draw a little line for the brim of his hat. And then you can come up here and we can give it a little dimension and draw an oval at the top and then draw the line back down. Maybe he needs a few feathers right here too. And a little ribbon and whatnot. And you could also outline his fingerprint head too, and maybe he needs a bow tie. I think so. Oh, he looks fancy. And then you would just keep doing that and think about all the different moods that you could express on these guys. So let's do another one. How about a girl? So maybe she needs long, wavy hair. So easy, I'm just making squiggly hair, spaghetti hair maybe. And then she's gonna just have a surprised look on her face. So we're gonna make her mouth open and super wide, almost like googly eyes, like circles with little polka dots in them. We need some wide eyebrows on her too, like, oh my gosh, what just happened? How about some cheeks or freckles? Freckles are better. And then when she's finished, we can kind of outline her head and make a tall neck. And you could keep doodling and doodling and go on and on. But let's look at some that I have in my own sketchbook. I love this guy um, right here in the middle because he has some little um, headphones on listening to his music. 
And we've got this girl, she's got her favorite necklace on, a cowboy, you can go on and on. But these are super fun. You can make one of all your family members maybe. Super fun, fingerprint friends.